Good morning, super cool party people. It's Saturday and I slept pretty well, but I had some really crazy dreams. All right, let me turn on the light because this does not want to focus on me. So I had a dream where someone was trying to kill me. <laughs> it was like, I think I was like a secret agent or something uh because we were into like this big fight and like i managed to like get in a vehicle because somebody was going past i was like oh my god can you take me to the hospital because like i was hurting and yeah so i was like oh crap and then it morphed into another dream where i when i first woke up i thought it was like a prison i was in and i was breaking people out of this prison but now that i'm thinking about it a little bit more it doesn't make sense because i was like make sure that you like cover your lock so you can get back in later so I think we were it was like a training facility kind of thing and we weren't allowed to leave unless someone came and grabbed us and brought us or something so we like left and I was like I remember like taking a pair of underwear and like cutting out the crotch and like using that so that the deadbolt wouldn't shut weird I know and then so like we were leaving and I feel like I felt kind of bad about letting people out. I don't know. And then all of a sudden I was with Prince Harry and, and Prince William and I don't know if they were actual princes in this or if they were just like looked like them. And I think I was either the likeness of Meghan Markle or Kate Middleton and because like they were two couples, clearly two couples. And we were like in some like rundown motel room because the two girls, us, we were on the run. It was so weird. I kind of like, I wish I could remember more because I know there was a lot more. I remember there being more, but anyways. It is currently a time. I think it's about 10. I slept pretty well, which is great. This is, this is, gotta figure out the hair thing. Um, but I'm gonna get dressed now, I think, and go have something to eat and check in with you later. I'm hoping to have a productive day. But we will see what happens because it's D&D today and I always find that D&D day is a little bit harder to be productive at. On with at, uh, words. Okay, bye. Alrighty, so I've started to get ready for the day. I just, I still, me and my hair is a struggle. Um, I think I'm going to film my D&D video here though because it's supposed to go out tomorrow. So we'll see if I can get it filmed and edit it today. Hopefully it's a short one. Uh, I'm gonna try using this as a backdrop today though, so we'll see if the lighting's okay. If not, I'll just go back to my usual. But first, I definitely have to do something with my hair because that's not happening. So I was sneaky and I just hung my old backdrop up here. It's just like the good old times when I was filming in the garage all the time. Anyway, I filmed it, so that's exciting. It is noon, so that's actually not too bad. So I have hope. I have hope that I can get this one edit it um before anything happens we do have to go downtown before i'm making a mess we do have to go downtown before D, &D because we need to pick up a few things i also need to cook D, &D food at some point here uh but i think if i can quickly get a head start on this and then maybe by one o'clock be cooking spaghetti should be okay yeah, let's try for that. Let's see what happens. All right, so I'm working on editing right now. I am not very deep into it, but it's really funny because as I was filming, I straight up forgot the name of the country that our characters are from. Like, we have been playing since, well, I've been playing since September. I straight up couldn't remember the name of the country. I had to look it up, which is crazy because like I said, it's been months, but it's going well. We're doing great and my body hurts a little bit from all this sitting, but it's okay. We'll, we'll sacrifice this. We gotta get it done. I have a big list here today of things to do. This is one of them. Filming was another one, so that's great because it's done. And then I put uploading because, you know, gotta upload as well. So we're making progress, but it's still a lot of sitting and a lot of work, but oh well. We did 
did it. It is edited. It is now exporting and it is 10 to 1. So I am right on track to start cooking spaghetti at 1. I, that's falling apart, but that's fine. Anyway, I'm feeling good. I think it was a pretty good one. I really like that I'm using my old backdrop again. So I think when you keep doing that, it yeah, it felt better. Anyway, I need to run upstairs and start cooking. So I'll check in with you in a little bit. All right, so spaghetti is cooked now. It's in the crock pot to just keep warm until D&D. &D. I like putting the crock pot early because then it just really infuses with all the flavors. <laughs> Who am I? Anyway, so I have three things left on my list. One is to upload this video that is still exporting, so can't really do that yet. Another one is my query letter, and then the final one is the first 10 pages of Emanate, which I keep writing as a merge, which is really bad because that's not the name of the book. And I accidentally, I like, thank God I read over my submission for <laughs> one of the queries that I sent because I wrote a merge instead of emanate. <laughs> that could have been bad. Anyway, so that, the three things, three things. I don't know if I'm gonna get them done. I mean, I'll definitely get the uploading done and the creeler is pretty much done. It's, it's the 10 pages of emanate that's really gonna take a long time. So mainly because I don't wanna do it, but, I think I'm gonna blow my nose because I have been so snuffly today, I don't know why, and then maybe be social? Maybe, maybe, maybe? Just to avoid doing the work? Okay, so they are watching Seinfeld upstairs. I don't particularly like Seinfeld, so I guess it is a sign to not be social and to work. So, reluctantly, reluctantly, I'm gonna do this. I'm not even like mad about doing it, I just don't wanna do it, so it's fine. It's fine. Okay, so I started editing and I'm really glad that I just finally dived into it because it's making me remember why I like my story so much which is like I think what I need it because I have just been dreading doing this and like the query letters aren't so much fun so I'm very happy oh my legs that I finally decided to jump into this and I'm like oh I'm like changing words here and there to make it a little bit better um but yeah I'm super jazzed I'm just trying to, I want to close my blinds, um, but it's sunny today. Look at that, it's dead sun, dead sun. But yeah, I'm super jazzed because I have not touched the story for like, I don't know, a while, probably sometime in December because then I start working on query letters. So super exciting. I'm so glad I got into this and I'm hoping that these first, it's like 10 and a bit pages, that going through these first couple pages will get me excited enough to want to go through all 134 pages at the end of the day because I really think that I should because it's been so long since I went through it and now that I've stepped away from it for like a month I'm hoping that I can like I know I'm a little wordy when I write which I think is okay but you know being concise is also good so you got to know when to use all the words and when to cut a bunch of the words so I'm hoping that when I get through this, I'm already on page six, so I'm over halfway through. So I'm hoping that when I get through with this, I'll be like, yeah, I love that so much. I wanna keep going. But before I do that, I need to at least stop and send off the query letter that I'm getting this ready to go with. It was a really bad English, but I think you got what I meant. So yeah, it is 10 to two now. One of our friends is coming over at two and then we're going downtown because the elliptical that I mentioned a couple days ago that we got, it's gonna go in our exercise room, but the socket for the plug-in out there is kind of not really in the wall very well, so we're gonna pick up a new one, and he's gonna help us put that in before Dungeons & Dragons, and I also wanna get a new one for my coax cable here, because that's where my internet comes through, but it's broken, so it just constantly sticks out, so I've taped it to the wall, and I've stuck this kind of heavy thing in front of it, but it would be nice to not have to do that so yeah we I'm having a super productive day and I'm feeling great about it and my story again and I think that is like the most important thing so yay okay so we went to the store and we were able to find the sockets that we need it for upstairs we couldn't find the thing that'll work for me so might have to Amazon that or something I don't know it's a really weird thing I've never seen one that looks like it before, although I'm sure obviously they exist. I got to chapter three um, out of three that my gabler, my 10 pages are, so that's exciting. I just need to do that. And um, I uploaded my video, so crushing the game today. As long as I can be productive tonight and finish getting through that, and then maybe just like double check my query letter, 
theoretically I can send it off tomorrow. That's pretty cool. But it's four o'clock now, which is D&D &D time. So I'm gonna just put a cozy sweater on because that one, very nice, but not super, super cozy. And um, time to get ready to do that. Alrighty, so it is 20 after 11 now. D&D &D ended just under an hour ago or probably just about an hour ago. Um, it was good. We also got our elliptical brought upstairs from the garage into the exercise room, so it is really coming along. I'll have to remember to show you guys in the next couple days because we have an elliptical, we have a bike. I put a shelf out there that has all the weights and stuff on it. We are like getting pretty legit here. Uh, and now I'm in my room. I was just watching some vlogs from when I went back to Blind Channel in November because I missed much and um yeah now i'm gonna sit down i'm gonna try to finish editing those first 10 pages like i want to and then maybe i'll look at the query letter and then hopefully tomorrow i can send that off which would be exciting that'd be number three then about halfway through what i want to send off to start because i was feeling like six was gonna be a good sample to start with of literary agencies so that's exciting but i'm gonna shut up right now i'm gonna put my headphones on and play some music and do that editing thing <laughs> Okay, you know what? I always do this. If I get really productive with writing, I forget that I have to edit the vlog at night. It's not that I forget that I have to edit it. I forget that I should put away time to do that because now it is 10 to 12 and I need to edit the vlog and it's going to take a while. So <sighs> this is why I don't get sleep sometimes. Anyway, with that, I'm going to say thank you for coming along on this productive day. This is like the most productive day I've had in a very long time, which is super exciting. I crossed everything off my list. Well, I haven't yet, but we're gonna do that right. Bam, everything is crossed off my list, which is super exciting because like, I haven't been particularly productive for like the last couple weeks. Basically, kind of like, I guess since I went to Florida, but. That's fine. But yeah, very exciting. So I will see you tomorrow when we do very similar things. Good night.